Garrett, advancing motion, also known as Garrett Motion, formerly Honeywell Transportation Systems and Honeywell Turbo Technologies, is an American company primarily involved in engineering, development and manufacturing of turbochargers and related forced induction systems for ground vehicles from small passenger cars to large trucks and industrial equipment and construction machinery. It originated as part of Garrett AirSearch's industrial division in Phoenix, Arizona in 1954, after which they entered a contract to provide 5,000 turbochargers for the Caterpillar mining vehicle. It manufactured turbochargers for railroads and commercial trucks. The business produced approximately $3.2 billion in revenue in 2011. Honeywell is also involved in motorsports providing turbochargers and forced induction systems, solutions and related equipment to racing teams and various forms of automobile racing and professional competitions. In 2004, the business became part of American industrial conglomerate Honeywell International, Inc. as their transportation systems division. In 2018, it was spun off to become an independent company under the Garrett, Advancing Motion name with corporate headquarters in Roll, Switzerland. History John Clifford Cliff Garrett founded the Aircraft Tool and Supply Company in a one-room office in Los Angeles in 1936. In 1938, the company changed its name to Garrett Corporation, consolidating several companies into one with three divisions. The company produced aircraft turbochargers for the war effort in World War II, as well as avionics, environmental controls and other products. In the 1950s, the city of Los Angeles and other municipalities started using turbochargers in their sewage purification operations. By 1952, 20,000 turbocharged engines were in use in the U.S. In order to explore applications of turbochargers for diesel engines, Garrett separated the turbocharger group from the gas turbine group on September 27, 1954, to form the AirSearch Industrial Division Aid. The first T-15 turbocharger was delivered to the Caterpillar Company in 1955. It was followed by an order for 5,000 production units, to be installed in the Caterpillar D9 tractor. The industrial division produced turbochargers for construction machinery, railroad locomotives, tractors, ships, power plants and oil pipeline pumping stations. The T-11 automotive turbocharger developed in 1960 expanded turbos to commercial vehicles such as the heavy trucks produced by Mack Trucks, Volvo and Scania. The first turbocharged passenger cars were the Chevrolet Corvair Monza and the Oldsmobile Jetfire in 1962-1963. In the 1960s turbochargers were used in race cars and sports cars, gaining an association with racing culture and auto enthusiasts. Company founder Cliff Garrett's death in 1963 was followed by a hostile takeover threat by Curtis Wright Corporation. To avoid this, Garrett Corporation merged with Signal Oil and Gas Company in 1964. The combined company adopted the name The Signal Companies in 1968 before merging with Allied Corporation to become Allied Signal Inc. The oil crisis of the 1970s made federal regulators put pressure on car manufacturers to reduce exhaust emissions. By 1977 manufacturers introduced turbocharged cars in the U.S. and Europe like the Buick Regal and LeSabre Sports Coupe as well as European cars by Volvo, Saab, Peugeot, Renault and Mercedes. In 1978 there were only eight turbocharged car models and seven used Garrett turbochargers. Garrett formed the Automotive Group in 1980 and by the mid-1980s there were over 100 turbocharged models. Turbochargers became commonplace by the 1990s. In 1994, Allied Signal acquired the Lycoming Turbine Engine Division of Textron, followed by the sale of the Garrett Aviation Division to General Electric three years later. In 1999, it merged with Honeywell International Inc. and adopted Honeywell as the company name. In 2011, Honeywell sold its automotive consumer products group to Rank Group, a New Zealand private investment firm, for $950 million. 
This included brands like Fram filters, Prestone antifreeze, and Autolite spark plugs. In the 2000s, Garrett's turbochargers were installed in the engines of the Chevrolet Sonic, Mercedes S 350, Volkswagen Polo, BMW X6 Active Hybrid, Ford F 350, Volkswagen Golf, and Jaguar XF, among others. In 2010 the company developed 15 new technologies for 100 new engines, including the world's first use of ball-bearing technology in a mainstream light vehicle diesel engine. Garrett has developed the world's smallest turbo for the Tata Nano as well as for the 100-liter engine of the Caterpillar mining truck. Topic. Business. On October 1, 2018, Garrett Motion Inc. became an independent publicly traded company through a pro rata distribution by Honeywell International Inc. parent or Honeywell of 100% of the then outstanding shares of Garrett to Honeywell stockholders the spin-off. Each Honeywell stockholder of record received one share of Garrett Common Stock for every 10 shares of Honeywell Common Stock held on the record date. Approximately 74 million shares of Garrett Common Stock were distributed on October 1, 2018 to Honeywell Stockholders Topic. Turbo Racing The Garrett brand competes in numerous motorsports series and supports sports car racing, drag racing, rally racing, and open-wheel racing. Racing vehicles using a Garrett Turbo include Topic. Technologies and products Garrett offers gasoline-powered turbochargers called wastegate turbos. They are designed to be smaller than previous turbo generations, have higher fuel efficiency, more torque, and meet emissions standards. Garrett also offers variable geometry turbochargers called VNT. They have nine movable vanes, an electrohydraulic actuator and a proportional solenoid for variable control throughout the engine's power curve. This means the air passageway of the turbo varies to meet the engine's needs at different RPMs. 40 million VNT turbochargers have been sold since the 1990s. VNT Duty Drive, previously called Double Axle VNT, uses 12 to 19 turbine nozzle vanes supported by twin axles for trucks and buses. Garrett also offers a diesel engine version of wastegate turbos and VNTs. Dual stage turbochargers use two smaller turbochargers either side by side, parallel, or in sequence, serial. The first is used at low speeds and a valve opens up the second as engine RPMs increase. The dual stage used in the Audi A6, A7 3.0-liter V6 engine however runs both turbochargers at a lower pressure mode and some use one larger turbo followed by a smaller one. The dual boost has dual compressors to mimic a twin turbocharger. Topic. Patents. Garrett Motion has patented a single cartridge, dual ball bearing technology, which uses a single sleeve system with a set of angular ball bearings on either end. This creates a rolling rather than sliding mechanism between parts intended to reduce the amount of pressure required to achieve airflow. 